So it is my grandfather's birthday today and his wife, grandmother, is in the rehab facility because she broke her hip and had to get a hip replacement because my mom's big dumb golden doodle smashed her onto the floor like an asshole. So we're doing a surprise dinner and look what my mom got. <laughs> We have some sweet potatoes, zucchini, and squash. You can't send one home and then the other one gets sick. She snuck wine into the nursing home. And ice cream. And ice cream. <laughs> and ice cream. And, ice cream. <laughs> and then she made a birthday cake. Yeah, speak to her. Cute. So cute. <laughs> So cute. She did. <laughs> oh, I'm so just don't forget any little last thing. You're hilarious. This is the woman behind the surprise birthday feast at the rehab facility. You killed it. Thank He's you. gonna really like this. Well, I don't know. No one's tried anything yet. This is really nice. Good morning everyone, it is Wednesday. So this is what I look like literally 90% of the time when I'm not filming. No makeup, <laughs> hair hasn't been washed in four days and I'm chilling. I'm sitting outside of my office right now. I gave Jonathan his birthday present last night and I just wanted to show you guys it because I'm kind of disappointed. I bought, um, I was teetering between Gucci slides or off-white slides and I don't really like the Gucci slides that are out right now and I feel like off-white is super trendy, especially for our age group. So I purchased a pair from Neiman Marcus and the box just came in this, it's just like a white box. <laughs> Literally a white box, like I could probably purchase this off Amazon for 99 cents if I wanted to start selling shoes. And they were $240. And then they came in this green bag. I know he's super minimal and like kind of industrial and I don't know, hi. Um, but it came in this like shit white or light green bag. And then these are the slides. I have to return them because I purchased an eight and a half and his feet were like just hanging off. And if you're gonna spend $240 on something, it might as well fit you properly so these are the slides that i purchased i don't know i just feel like if you're spending 240 dollars on something the packaging should be nicer like that's what you love about gucci and louis vuitton is the unboxing and it's so beautiful and these were absolute shit. so when i handed them to him yesterday he was just like really erin like this is bad so today I am just working a half day because I have an event later on tonight and Chelsea's gonna come with me. Um, my friend Chelsea, you haven't met her yet, but yeah. So Chelsea's gonna come with me and I will check back in with you guys later on today when Chelsea and I are on our way to the event. Hey guys, I forgot that I was seeing Braylee today. So I haven't seen you in what, like two weeks? Maybe more. Yeah. I haven't seen her in like two weeks. I think I came for like a solid two weeks and I actually was doing really well with my workouts and felt strong. And then I took two weeks off just because I had a ton of people visiting me. So I'm seeing her today, tomorrow. Hopefully I get back on track and being in shape. She is going to be recording a couple of the workouts because I embarrass the shit out of myself when I do the ropes. These are like the worst things ever but she's setting up my training. I'm gonna stretch out and then we're gonna get right into the workout.
So we're at a nut and vlog by the way. So we're at a networking event for a real estate office. And they have a full hot air balloon and they're doing rides. I'm kind of scared. See sales are cool, isn't it? This is why everyone should be in sales jobs, because there's a ton of bullshit money to spend on bullshit things. This is a weird angle, I apologize. I am currently driving to 7.15 a.m. meeting that I have every single Thursday for a networking group I'm in. Um, I cannot believe I pulled myself together this well, this early after last night. Last night was so freaking cool, so cool. The networking event um, was open bar and then it was kind of like barbecue style with hamburgers and hot dogs and whatever um and then they had that hot air balloon which was so cool to go in i don't think i'll ever go in one again it was wicked freaking hot like super super hot but it was a lot of fun we went out after um with a bunch of people and grabbed dinner i'm obsessed with boom boom shrimp i can't stop thinking about them or eating them the best are at Black Whale if you're local and want to go eat them and try them. Um, but yeah, so Chelsea had a lot of fun. She had never been to a networking event before. Anyways, today I'm on my way to this networking group. A lot of people don't like public speaking and it's my jam, so I'll be doing that at 7 o'clock in the morning. I'm extremely sore from seeing Braylee yesterday. Honestly, it hurts to even be holding up my phone right now. so sore and I'm in heels all day I'm an idiot I keep forgetting my actual camera and using my phone and I know the quality was so poor well at least when I watched my last vlog I could seriously tell the difference between my videos that came off of my phone and my videos that came off of my camera it's just annoying because I don't want it just jamming around in my purse or leaving it in my car because it was pretty expensive so I gotta figure out something or like schedule certain times to vlog and maybe not just vlog literally my entire life but I'm learning so I will check back in you guys are gonna be sick watching this because I'm like ah! okay I'll check back in later bye guys where's daddy he's not behind that door come find him I don't know where he is He's not over there. He's still not over there. I don't know. I don't know, Mama. Look, he's not over here. He's not over there, Callie. Kelly. Go ahead, babe. <laughs> Good morning. Today's Friday. Thank God. I washed my hair last night, so you can probably tell that it looks so soft and bouncy and just better than after seven days. Uh, Braylee recorded me yesterday. I don't know what she's going to do with the video, but Braylee's my trainer. She was like, I can see your muscles, and I've never been able to see muscles in my body because I am so damn thin. Thin. I like there's nothing to me but bones and silicone um, <laughs> no I'm just kidding but she said she saw muscles yesterday so I was so happy I like called Jonathan as soon as I left the gym because I was so excited good morning it's Saturday it's kind of gloomy out hi Cal can you see her this is what I deal with she's seriously my shadow oh she's coming around the other side Or maybe she's just napping. So, Jonathan and I... She's leaving. Wow. Jonathan and I went to dinner last night and then just went to bed. I'm still so tired. I feel like I'm catching up on sleep still from last week. But he's working, of course. That's all he does. And I just picked up the house. This is what I look like. 99.9% .9 of my life. And... I'm going to get ready. I actually woke up to my 
recent video, uh, me doing Lexi's makeup while drinking, being blocked because of copyright, but I thought that you could use an artist's song for at least 30 seconds in your video, and I only use 10 seconds. Oh, she wanted to go get her ball. You wanna show them your ball? Oh, what a cool ball, Cal. Hey, show them your ball. She wanted to go get her ball for you guys. What an angel. So yeah, my video got blocked, which I thought was super weird and annoying. So I had to go remove the song and upload it again. So dumb. And I think YouTube only lets you get flagged for copyright three times. And that wasn't even intentional and I knew what I was doing. So high key annoyed. What do you mean no? No, I want to take a photo. Oh, yeah. Take a photo with Dina. Oh. Maddie. I swear, every time I leave the house, I forget to put on mascara. It's only when I'm filming that I ever remember. I keep mascara in my car, in every single purse I own. I'm so bad. I'm probably going to be doing it in the parking lot as soon as I pull up to brunch with Casey. I really had to disconnect yesterday. Uh, social media, obviously, you see whatever people want you to see. And yesterday, I did not want to be seen. Um, I put a lot of my life out there, especially with vlogs now, YouTube filming. I definitely relate to some personal stuff. Instagram, Facebook, everything. I'm pretty active on social media. But that doesn't mean that you see everything that is going on in my life. And... I don't think people really understand that. Uh, social media is lit. Wow, what am I doing? Oh, there's a tit shot. Social media is literally what I want you to see. And there's a lot of stuff that goes on behind the scenes in my life that maybe I don't know how to deal with properly or it's none of your damn business. Uh, I don't know. So yeah, yesterday was kind of hard for me and I emotionally needed to just like chill and ground myself and reconnect. So I spent some time with my husband and my best friend and her kids, because I love them more than life. And today I'm ready to just take on a new day. I just wanted to vent a little bit about boys and grown ass men having responsibility and chores in a household. I work full time. I work out every chance I get. I have YouTube, which obviously takes a lot of time between filming and editing and marketing it and coming up with content. I don't think that I should be the only one to maintain a household. I don't think anyone should be the only one to maintain a household. I'm talking so much crap about my husband right now on Instagram because I just don't get how a 30 year old man can take his shoes off and place them outside of the closet and not open the door and put them in the closet. That sounds really hard. Maybe I need to make a YouTube. You know, oh my God, I'm gonna make a YouTube tutorial on how to put your shoes in a closet for men and how to put your clothes away when your wife has already washed, dried, and folded them for you. Wow, that's genius. Honestly, what? How many people are in the world? How is that not a gold mine to teach men how to do basic chores in life? It's wild. I can't believe I thought of that all on my own. Insane.